So are you also looking to use your WhatsApp account on multiple devices? No god. Then this video is just for you. As in this video I'm going to be showing you how you can set up and enjoy WhatsApp's multi-device features seamlessly. So previously you needed separate phone numbers to access WhatsApp on multiple phones. You think I didn't think of that? Of course I thought of that. But with the 2024 update, things have been changed, enabling the use of a single WhatsApp account on several devices at once. So to get started and use multiple device support, you first have to link your WhatsApp account to another device. So the first method is of course linking your computer or your laptop or MacBook. So for the demonstration purpose, we are using our iPhone and we are going to be web accessing on our MacBook. But the process works similarly for the WhatsApp desktop application on Windows as well. So on your phone, first open WhatsApp and here just tap on link devices. And here you'll see this option of use WhatsApp on other devices where you can link other devices to this account including Windows, Mac and Web. So here just tap on link device and it will ask for face ID and this scan QR code prompt will open. So now you have to go to your Mac and here open Safari browser and here just search for WhatsApp web. Then click on the first link and here QR code will be shown. Now just take your phone and here tap on OK and you just have to scan the QR code that is shown on your MacBook. So let's do that. And after logging in, your device has been linked. And now you can use your WhatsApp account like this on your MacBook, Windows or on web. And now let's say if you want to log out. So just tap here and here you'll see the option of log out. Just tap on it. And then again tap on log out. And it will automatically log out from your MacBook as well. Now there's another option as well if you just tap on link device again. And tap on OK. And here you'll see this option of link with phone number instead. So just tap on it. And here you'll get a code. So now you have to do the same thing on WhatsApp web as well. So just tap on login with phone number and here you have to enter your phone number and after you have added your number just tap on next and then you will get a code on your MacBook. So you just have to add that code here and after that's done it will start to log in. And again our WhatsApp has been linked to our another device that is our MacBook with a different method of logging in with phone number instead of QR code if you want to do that. Now let's talk about our second method that is linking with another phone. And I'm sure there are lots of people who carry two phones with them. So if you have any other secondary phone and you want to use the same WhatsApp that you are using in your primary phone onto the other phone then just follow these steps. So let's say this is our primary phone and this is our secondary phone. So make sure that you have already installed WhatsApp on your secondary phone. And once you've done that, just open it and here tap on agree and continue. And here you don't have to add your number. You just have to tap on these three dots on the right side of the screen. So just tap on it and here you'll see this option of link as companion device. Again, just tap on it and here you'll see another QR code flashing on your screen, which you can use to scan the code so that you can use WhatsApp on more than one phone. So now the app will prompt you to scan a QR code from your primary phone. So let's do that. First of all, open WhatsApp and then here just tap on settings and then again, just tap on link devices and again, tap on link device. Just add your code and tap on OK. And then again, you have to scan this QR code here. And then again, it will start to log in once you have scanned your QR code. And as you can see, it's loading the chats here. And it's also shown that Android phone is now active, which means that our WhatsApp account has been linked to both of these devices. So now let's wait for it to load all of the chats. One eternity later. And as you can see, all our chats are being shown here in our secondary phone as well. So this method was pretty easy, right? But keep in mind that this companion mode has its limitations also, as it cannot use live location sharing or status updates. And also, if your primary phone has not been connected to the internet for straight 14 days, then all of your linked devices will automatically be logged out. So you have to keep that in mind. So these were the ways by which you can use the multi-device feature on any other phone or even Windows or MacBook without of course getting a new number to use it on your secondary phone. And if you have any queries, do let us know in the comment section. We'll definitely help you out. And if you've reached it, then definitely like this video, share it with your friends and family. And also don't forget to subscribe to Geekify. With that, I'll see you guys in the next video. Till then, keep enjoying your life.